Hey everybody, welcome back to the Gramophone Channel. We're still doing our CES 2023 coverage, but today we're making a very special stop as Harman is essentially doing their own expo here in Vegas, and it is just as impressive. We have a fantastic lineup here for our JBL Party Box category. So everything from Encore Essential, which is ultra portable, you can take it anywhere, um, all the way up to our 710 and 1000, which is more for, for your home. That thing is a beast. Pool. It's unbelievable. Yeah. And I think really what's at the core of this is three main things. So it's the fantastic, really dynamic JBL sound performance based on our heritage of professional audio. Um, dynamic light show that really syncs with the music and the ability to customize the light show as well within our JBL Party Box app. Um, and then last but not least, the ability to, to play and sing along. And so we're on to the next one though, and I'm here with my friend Jim, and Jim's gonna tell us about some of the really cool new studio monitor related products, including a new active model that I think is really cool, because you guys know me, I love active speakers. I think they're awesome. Jim, what do you got for us? So last year at CES, we introduced the first fully active studio monitor speaker, the 4305P. It went on to win a number of awards last year, and what we just introduced two days ago here at the Harman Explore event is the big brother, the 4329P. Yeah, this thing has some pretty stupendous performance, and this really sounds like a floor standard with a subwoofer. It's got very mm. deep bass. It'll play all the way down to 30 hertz. You get some room gain in it, maybe a little bit more into it, so very solid bottom end out of the speaker. We've got a lot of patents around the technology that we do for both compression drivers and our horn technology. Mm. So this is our high definition imaging horn geometry. So it's based on decades of research and refinement. The great thing about these is there's no other components required for them. You buy a pair of these, take them out of the box, plug them into an AC wall outlet, connect to your network and off you go. We're now gonna talk about one of the best demo theaters I think I've yet seen. This is a pure JBL synthesis theater. So what's great about a JBL synthesis system is it's a system solution. We don't really sell products. We do products that were designed and engineered to work together as a system from the beginning. We help specify the system as far as getting the right components for that room, where they should go. And then once the room's installed, it's getting a proper calibration on it. So mm. we do that to the Harman target curve so we get a guaranteed level of response. We've got our new certified systems program that goes along with us so that you know that as the integrator, you guys know what you're doing with it, and as the factory system, uh, the owner is going to have that assurance that they know they've got something that meets our stringent standards. All the classic series stuff is just cool. It's that mid-century modern look, but now filled with contemporary tech and speaker design. Well, Jim's going to tell us about how that really kicked off a revolution for JBL. So that really inspired us to go back and create an entire range of classic series electronics. Awesome. That's what we've introduced here at the uh, Harman Explorer event. And so I've got four new products that we want to walk you through and show off how you can create a complete system now with JBL Classic Electronics to go with your classic series loudspeakers. In the center is the new SA550, which is an integrated amplifier. And it has got a our G Class amplifier in it, 90 watts of channel in it. It's got a movie magnet phono stage of course so you compare with the turntable it's got high-res Bluetooth connectivity in it as well and a DAC built in to go with that then we've created three source players so we've got two digital source players and of course an analog one mm. period correct for that so on the left side here what you're looking at is the new mp350 and that is uh, our streaming audio player so that gives you Chromecast and airplay connectivity you can put it on your network it can be a ruin in point there's still a lot of CD players being sold a lot of people that want them and they want to be able to listen to those huge collections that we've hung on to. So we are introducing the CD350, which is a dedicated CD player that you see there on the top. It does have a USB uh, drive input on it as well, so if you want to play some files, nice. you certainly could. But it's first and foremost a CD player. And then if you look over to the right, what we're looking at there is the new TT350. And this is a, uh, a turntable that we've created in a a vintage 1970s approach. It's a direct drive player and includes an Audio-Technica cartridge ready to go, uh, moving magnet set up on that. That's a cool piece. So now we can spend some records on it. So we can do the digital sources on the left with CD and streaming. And that's a great package that I think is right sized for the L52 and the L82 loudspeakers. And if you look over there in the corner too, more walnut wood veneers, so that Ooh, is Ooh, is that a new sub? That is a new sub. That is the L10CS that we've created, and it's got a 10-inch white cone down-firing driver in it, 500-watt amplifier, all the connectivity you want on the back, 
And so that's just a great way to add some bottom end to, again, either the smaller bookshelf loudspeakers or the L75MS all-in-one music system. Well, so many people love the L100 loudspeaker, the smaller L82, L52. So the performance has always been a, a huge draw for them. But the design aesthetic is certainly something that you like it or you don't like it, and it may not fit your decor. If you live in a home that's more contemporary or more elegant, clean design, that's not going to work for you necessarily. So we created the Black Editions here and wanted to create something that's a little more sophisticated, a little more modern, a little more elegant finish. So wrapping these in that high gloss piano back finish and giving them a unique logo with the gold grill logo on it, the gold accents on the front and rear of the loudspeakers, just really created, I think, a speaker that looks very different. Oh yeah. Uh, very uh, much a sophisticated, elegant looking product in it. So these will be an exclusive throughout 2023. So you want to get to the store and check them out, get your hands on some. We've got one more product that we're going to show you here with an interview with Jim and he's going to tell us all about it. This is another turntable, but if you look closely, it kind of almost has that JBL party box aesthetic to it a bit and it looks just downright awesome. Jim, what's going on with this guy and why does it look so cool? <laughs> it is cool. So this is the new JBL Spinner BT, of course stands for Bluetooth. So this is our first Bluetooth turntable. And we've created this as we've got a whole new generation of listeners that are getting into vinyl again. And they're used to the connectivity that they've gotten from portable products and sound bars and things mm. like that. So what we've wanted to do is to create a turntable that can interface with any of those products. With the high-res Bluetooth that's built into it, you can connect it directly to headphones, to one of our portable speakers, nice. to a sound bar, okay. or what we're doing here, a party box solution on it. And this is a, a really cool way to create a, a pretty unique system. Jim, thanks so much for hanging out with us and taking us through all these awesome product lines. Guys, I hope you've had as much fun as I have going through this stuff. At least, that's our goal. Stay tuned. There's still more to come from the Harmon Expo, and we've got a lot to check out here in beautiful Las Vegas. Be seeing you.